Welcome back Tothi channel, today the new Ho clan dropped, let's get into the game and check them out. Here they are, let's see their preview movies. And the female. Now let's take a look at the skills. The male's active skill seems similar to that of the Zaris clan, but does damage over time rather than in one hit. He also has additional boosts based on soul marks. Having read the skill description I'm hoping that there is a typo regarding 36 soul marks and enemy strength stolen from, that is from, the caster. For his ultimate skill he has a similar power, except this time his attack is in the center of the battlefield usually where early clashes happen, and he gains sold marks for each enemy or ally killed during the effect. And again, he gets a boost depending on the number of soul marks he currently has. We will need to watch his attacks carefully as this seems like a new mechanic they are adding. For his passive skill, he gains soul marks every time an enemy or ally loses a percent of their max health. He gains 2% strength permanently for every soul mark as well as other boosts to skills. Overall, if the soul mark game mechanic works well on launch, he could be a powerful replacement for anyone using the male Zares. We will need to look at their clan trait to see how he works in a team dynamic though. Let's take a look at the female skills. Her active skill is tailored towards crown control isolating two potential threats to your team. She will silence the enemy with the highest energy level and paralyze the enemy with the highest strength, dealing a good amount of damage to both. For her ultimate skill, she casts protection on her allies, not as strong as a shield but slows the rate of which you receive a percent of the damage. The skill also gives of a good amount of instant healing when the skill is cast. The healing amount is comparable to that of the male loom and female white eyes so could be a good third healer. If want to focus on group healing rather than single target healing with female Eason. For her passive skill, skipping over the confusing first line, she will heal an ally by a percent of their max health, raise their attack speed by a percent, and recover 250 energy over the 5 second duration. We can see that she is a competent healer like the male loom or female white eyes, but unlike them she can also deal a high amount of damage. She is an interesting one to go for to support your teams. Now that we've taken a look at the skills, let's take a look at their 3D models so we can a feel for the champion, whilst you think on whether you want to go for them in the upcoming event.
Thank you for joining me whilst we check out the Ho clan. Join me during the second half of the event where I'll share my summons with you and take a close look at the trait and team formation.